Ja that is a Grimen. huge, huge crop, man. I'm going for a walk like I'm headed to the lake. Looking for a place to go. Cast my life away when I'm on the water. Only time I ever feel sane. Nod your head to what I'm saying if you understand my pain. He was looking for a crappy kitty cat or just a bass. Hold him up inside my life. I'm holding crispy for a snack. Now my boat's broke again. No reason for me to not get shot. Get up to sniff the money straight out my pocket. Hey, now, people always ask. G4 Outdoors! Why are you guys always on the water? Always. Cause that's where we're at peace! You got peace somewhere! Find me on the water, that's, that's where, where I'm, I'm at, at peace. peace! Now the boat's up and running, so I'm back out on the lake With some friends that I met up on the lake the other day Now as you listen to the song, it's probably got you in a trance But understand that these crappies do not stand a single chance So as I turn around, I got a crappie on the hook Watch me scream at the top of my lungs to make you look Yo, that ain't a crappie, that's a big old bass Watch it breach out the water, make a big old splash Fish won't stop fighting, this battle's been so hard Everybody's straight soaked like rides at a water park Now we finally calm down, I got him up on the scale Ten pounds Six ounces, almost a killer whale I'm calling everyone I know, even people in jail Say you gotta check this fish, I got him here on the scale Now I'm taking all my pictures, I send him to Facebook Did you keep it? Well no, they really don't taste good Catch and release, I'm letting the bass go Looking for the crappie, that was the main goal I said one, two, three, four Get those crappies on the floor Now I'm setting all these hooks, while keeping my rod straight How'd you get so strong? From using the shake weight So if you digging this story, thinking you want more Head to YouTube now, G4 Outdoors. <laughs> Every everybody thinks all these stories are fake. These are all fake. factual. I'm out there on the block. Every day. <laughs> What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to this episode of Jeep 4 Outdoors. Today we're going to be getting on some crappie. Stick around. Hope you enjoy the video. What is that? What? What is that? Oh, nothing. What is that thing? Just a crappie. Oh. Got Randy and Braden in the front of the boat. He's grabbing some minnows. I'm just gonna show you guys what we are using today. This is either a size two or size four offset octopus hook. It is chartreuse and we just have a small, I couldn't even tell you what size sinker that is. And we're just dropping minnows on some brush piles here on Smithville Lake. We got a couple in the boat already, but I'm gonna grab the camera and start recording so Randy and Braden here can get on some fish. So just a small one, but we are fishing this brush pile right here, main lake, main point, uh, six to eight foot down. There is a conservation brush pile right below us, but it is holding a lot of big fish right now. This one's small, but there's a lot of big ones down there. Let's get on them. I was just retying on a lure. Ja that is a Crimin. huge, huge crappie, man. We're gonna have to get the measure on that fella. For sure, this is absolutely your PB. 100% your PB. I think this PB is the largest copy. one out of the water. Oh my Like God. not in a fish tank, this is probably the largest one I've seen. Let's check this thing out. So we're gonna go ahead and grab the weight first, and then we're gonna measure and see how long this fish is. But I'm impressed. One pound, three ounces. Unimpressed, one six. One six, that's bigger than I thought it was. That's not a bad fish at all, dude. I thought one it was six bigger. is legit. But that is, I'm, um, that. That's a Smithville Lake monster. I don't have to hold this one out. That is a monster. Let's get a measurement. So we're looking at a 14 and three quarter inch crappie here. Ain't nothing wrong with that thing. You wanna check them out, buddy? Yeah. 14 three quarter and one one six pounds. There ain't nothing wrong with that thing. Check that thing out, Braden. That's probably the biggest crappie you have ever seen, dude. Up. Randy's already got three fish. I'm still kind of a little bit injured. It actually hook, hurts when I set the hook. I don't know if you guys get that because you're so good at fishing that your arm gets stressed out from setting the hook. But Randy <laughs> is gonna try to get Braden on a crappie. Finally, with a little bit of trial and error, Braden got himself a crappie. Get him in the boat, buddy. Scoot on back. There you go. Scoot back. Let's check this fish out, dude. What you got? That's a good looking like football crappie pounder. right there. That's a good one, dude. Just a little one pounder, nothing too much. Hey, he counts. He counts. So Braden just got himself another one. What are we looking at? About You're a looking little at 10 incher. About a 10 inch crappie probably weighs, I'm going to give it 0. 0.6 or 0. 0.7. I wouldn't even worry about weighing it, buddy. Good fish. Let's get him in the live well. He's bleeding a little bit. Not a little bit. Those gill hooks. 
Look at that monster right there. Oh, there's there. a giant in there for sure. <laughs> Don't, but we do. Yes. Womp, womp. Braden just got another one, probably another nine, ten incher. These are my favorite eating ones, though. Yeah, you. Here, we keep ahead, a lot this. of those. Give me this. Around the back. Okay, nice. What's, what's in the What's in the live well? Open that up big. So just finishing up fishing in this. Uh, brush pile off the main lake. We're gonna go find another one. This one's still producing. We just want to check out some of the new spots. Like I said, we don't usually fish with live bait. We don't usually fish with minnows. So I like to see how these fish act differently compared to using your soft plastic jigs over those minnows. So let's find out. So just remember, if we win, I'm using the footage. If we lose, you'll never see it. <laughs> so Randy's over here. This is his dad out here on the Alumacraft and him and his dad are gonna line them up like some old 60s drag racers. We got the Tracker Targa V19 150 versus the Alumacraft 150. You guys gonna race? Finally beat your dad. <laughs> so guys, I don't even know if this video really had a storyline to it. Uh, took Braden out fishing today. We did amazing on crappie. Uh, I caught seven. Seven. We all caught a bunch of crappie. Taking some big ones home. Got some subscribers out here on the lake that we met up with. Uh, Jeff Shaw. Uh, Jeff, say hi. hi. Hello. That's it. <laughs> Com completely came over here and invaded our fishing area uh, but anyways guys i hope you like this video if you did as a matter of fact there will be a video coming out on the decals on this boat check that out we got a g4 outdoors decaled up on this boat and i think that's about all for this video so hit that like button hit the subscribe button leave a comment down below i will see you in the next one we're out Tuesday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Wednesday Thursday. Thursday. I just dream of fishing while I'm going through my workday. I listen to my boss, though he's driving me berserk. Eh? Damn it, I can't take much more because my brain is really hurting. And now the bank is always calling and I don't know what to do. And I haven't bought a crankbait since like 1992. But the bass are out there school.